name is John C. <laughs> Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Shiv101 and today I'm going to be telling you a story and stuff and I hope you guys like that intro right there. I know you guys didn't probably see that coming. You probably didn't see that coming so you know it's okay. Be pissed you know. You know what I'm saying? It's like the new Rick Rollin. You know what I'm saying? Alright so I'm going to be telling a story how I almost got scammed. It's kind of like I wouldn't have I don't know how to like kind of say it. It's like if I was like dumb back then, then I probably would have done it. But I, I wasn't dumb, so I really didn't get scammed. But it was a scam. So what is the scam is is a Coca Cola scam. So like like when I was like I think two to like last year like two years ago, what happened was Coca Cola sent me sent me an email saying that you won. 500,000 pounds from Coca-Cola from a um, giveaway or something like that and I didn't enter in anything and this email just came out randomly just like I didn't even know where it came from uh, I was like I was skept skeptical about it you know I knew it was a scam but I was just like um, okay this is weird like I don't know how to explain it so like, I looked at the email and it said oh here in our store at our factory I mean at our factory in Los Angeles, California, we have picked the name, and you are the winner. Please put in your information below. And I had like a like five paragraphs of explaining like how I won, what's like what it is, and blah blah blah. And if I probably did it, I would have got scammed. I know that for a fact. Like, you think Coca Cola knows me? Like, I'm probably like the worst person you could probably know out of like anybody. Like. I am so small, like, I, I don't know, I'm just small, like, you know what I mean? Like, out of YouTube, they're probably going to recognize me out of all the people. I don't think that's happening. Oh, yeah. And I was trying to, like, do a 360 with my little van right here. I, I know, I'm really bad, like, but you're actually going to be seeing a lot of GTA videos, like, with my friends and all that. We're, we actually have so much fun. We go in, like, lobbies, kill VIPs, do all this shit, get hired by VIPs, leave, and then just, like, murk everyone. It's fun. It's really fun. You guys are going to see that on my channel. Okay, I'm going off topic. I'll go back. So, like, yeah, I got this letter saying, yeah, you've, um, from our factory in LA, we picked out one name, and you are the winner. Th this is how much? 500 pounds. And I was like, wait factory in LA pounds if I'm not mistaken that's British that's British like currency I think yeah that's British currency I'm pretty sure it's British currency so like I was like okay yeah of course no shit that it's like not not real you know like pounds and LA can't be real or, or there's like there, I don't think there's like a place in LA and like um, England or like the UK or something like that so you know I was like okay this is weird this is and then I read the whole thing the whole message got me dying it was the funniest thing ever they try to explain how like I won and all this and how it makes sense and whatever and then they they're like at the end of, at the end of them um at the end of the um email they were like oh this is what you have to do. Put in your email, your email password, your bank account, your bank account number, your credit card, and your credit card password, or something like that. Something along the lines of that. And then I was just uh, like laughing so hard. So then I directly took it to Twitter. I barely, I didn't even have followers on Twitter. I just wanted to put it. I put up, immediately took the screenshot of the email, put it up, send it to Coca Cola, and then just for the laughs, I was like, to Coca Cola, is this real? <laughs> uh, of course they wouldn't like you know respond to me like they probably their feed is probably just flooding with fans I mean not fans but like you know people that just like you know at them in videos or like tag them or whatever it is so yeah of course they're not gonna find it and then I did a video actually back then explaining the the email and stuff like that but I kinda deleted it since I was really young and 
I don't know, it just didn't feel right. I, I deleted a lot of them because I was really young and embarrassed. Like, they were so bad. Like, now I have editors and, like, I can do what I want right now. Because I used to edit with my iPod and stuff. And it was, like, it was funny how I used to edit. It was, like, in Video Shop. Like, the app was actually called Video Shop. And, like, I had to, like, find ways I can glitch, like, my computer, like, USB files. Because I used to use camera. So, like, USB files are, like, um the, the um, um, what's it called memory card or whatever like onto the iPod just like it, it was like it was weird but um I managed but it was bad and then I did vlogs about it which I really didn't like, like I could do vlogs but it's like it's not like interesting like I would just stand there in front of the camera like hey guys um this is blah 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 whatever whatever so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video how I, I almost got scammed by fake Coca Cola. Uh, see you guys next time and peace. Be sure to uh, hit the subscribe button and like. Blah, blah, blah. I messed that up so bad. <laughs> be sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and go check out my other video. Like, you know, and um, there's gonna be a few surprises in there. I'm not gonna get your hopes up, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace. It's boy, been your boy, Shiv 101. Peace. And his name is John C. <laughs>